everyday superpower signing in with a tidbit discussion conversation engagement communication meditation what is art what is art is everybody an artist or is art limited to those who create in the public what is art who is an artist is everybody an artist everybody creates their own image through one way or another whether that be through their physical habits or through the items of clothing they choose to wear and display it's expression what is art? is it art if it does not evoke an emotional response? does art need to create an emotional response? and does art need to be honest? Is it still art? Is it a piece of artwork that has been created by an artist if it is not honest and is not a genuine part of oneself? Does it still classify as self-expression if it's superficial? If it's nonsensical? Whereas one would say a black painted box is not art another would say it is because we're here talking about it right now it's given you more food for thought more room for discussion and opened your mind up and exposed you who you are and I'm here exposing myself in response to this product as opposed to the grand renaissance painting that sits opposite as to which we're not paying attention to does art have limitations is every single thing art because everything has space for thought and discussion you can project what you want upon near on just more or less anything right Can you call yourself an artist if you don't consciously create what society may consider art? Are you still an artist? Are you an artist in your manner of getting out of bed on a morning? Your manner of doing so is individual to you. You have your own patterns and movements. Is that art in itself? Can you imitate somebody else and be an artist does it have to be original works or can it be can you be a rip-off artist that's what they call them right is a rip-off artist an artist is a con man an artist is there an art in everything you do is a bricklayer an artist can he call himself an artist? He creates and he builds and he turns nothing into something and he aligns the bricks one by one ensuring that he creates to the best of his capabilities. He is a creationist, he is an artist. Somebody who paints pictures on a canvas is considered an artist but do we consider the painter and decorator an artist somebody who comes in and paints an entire room white prior to the moving in of another individual a tradesman that's what we would call him on the professional aspect but could we also call him an artist and if not why not
What's the difference? What's the difference between a tradesman painting an entire room a colour and the artist that has painted that box black? The artist who has painted that canvas deep black in order to provoke that emotional response that we spoke of earlier regarding the two people. If nobody knows about it and nobody talks about it, is it still art? Do we base artistic value upon the reaction it provokes or do we approach the quality of the art through the time spent and invested, the ticket cost on the piece, the artist himself, his identity, Did you know that some of the leading artists' work are just chosen for whichever purpose by the rich to skyrocket the cost of their works and to hide their own money? Did you know that? As a means of hiding money, you can invest hundreds of thousands, if not million, into a painting. Sounds like a smart way to do it, right? No, I can't pay you back. I've got no money at the moment. Whilst you have millions of Basquiat in the house. Is a traffic light a work of art? It's very colorful. It's functional, it works. It triggers you as a human. What is art? What is art? I can't tell you the definition of art because I wouldn't care for the meaning. The dictionary meaning, I wouldn't care for it. Because I see the question and answer as a personal philosophical reasoning what do you think